guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do another thrift haul just to show you um, a couple more things that I found at Goodwill because I come to realize that if you like shopping at Buffalo Exchange or Crossroads, it's the same thing except Goodwill, I think you can find better prices, you know, so anyway, let's get started. But first hit the subscribe button and hit the like button and hit the bell for notification. So this first dress I have on is Lulu's. And it still had the original tags on it when I bought it. And Goodwill was selling it for $9. Not bad, right? Brand new, never been worn. Okay. Um, this next piece is a Batman versus Superman top. Now, it looks like this could be for a really big person. Or you can wear it as a dress. I'm going to wear it as a dress with some thigh-high boots and some tights. Um, and this one was six bucks. Not bad. The next piece is this beach cover up by SG Paradise. This is made in India. So look at the detail on this wrap. Beautiful. Um, I wish it was big enough to wear as a dress because I feel like this cut, it looks good on everyone's body type. And coral, I love this on my skin. And this one was $6. I mean, easily this could be $50. If you found this in Santa Monica, if you went to Santa Monica Beach right now and there's a store, this would easily be $50. Next is this little skirt from Zara Laser Cut Cream Skirt. Look at that. Look at the detail. And not only that, but it's cream and it's in perfect condition. Like, I know it's hard to find stuff at Buffalo Exchange or even like a regular store like H&M. <laughs> Sometimes you got something white that you like and you get in the dressing room and then you see that has makeup stains and lipstick stains all over it. This one is in perfect condition. I couldn't believe it. And it says $9, but I know for a fact I didn't pay full price. I think I got it like 50 or 25% off of this price. But beautiful. And I'm gonna style it with a vintage 80s blouse. I'm gonna try to make a monochromatic look with it. Beautiful, right? And last but not least is this beautiful Grecian goddess dress by Ceremony. And it's by Johanna August. And this one was also $9. But look at the detail. I love this dress so much. The color, I'm not in love with the color. It was just the fabric and the detail, how they made this dress is what made me love it. Um, it's like a muted gray. I don't know. But let's get started. I can't wait to try this stuff on. So first up is the Lulu dress and I styled it with some thigh high suede red boots, but if you have yellow boots, that would be amazing too. I think it would really pop with this dress. Now, I am holding the slit open because I wish this is how they kind of designed it. <laughs> I mean, this is how it would look, you know, if you let it go. So, kind of defeats the purpose of wearing knee-high boots, but yeah. <laughs> oh, well. And I saw it with um, my leopard purse I got it on a Royal Caribbean cruise. Unbelievable. That's $10 ever spent. So, what do you think? Next is the SG Beach cover up. But first, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and hit the bell for notification. So, don't you feel like you're on vacation in this thing? You see what I mean? How you want it to be longer to wear it as a dress? Oh my god, the cut of this, the, the color, it's just beautiful. And then look at this tie right here. Do you even think about it? Tie try it on right now. I mean, it's not necessary, but you can kind of use it as an accessory. Make it look like a necklace, you know? Isn't that cute? Oh, I love it. My bag I found at the dollar store. Now, the thing about the dollar store, you have to be careful. It's hit or miss. I've only used this bag a couple of times and the zipper has already broken. But the color is beautiful. I love this bag so much. It's big, it fits a lot of stuff. Um, whenever I go on shoots or whatever, or jobs where I'm gonna be away for like 10 hours in a day, this fits everything I need. So, 
I love it. Oh, and my shoes are nine less, and they actually kind of go with the bag too, huh? Love it. And it, actually, it has a little coral in it to match the cover up. I love this. I love this so much. I can't believe it. Whoever gave this away, big mistake. <laughs> Next is the little mini cream skirt from Zara. And I love this look so much. I made it monochromatic. I kept the buttons open at the top a little bit because it's giving me Tom Ford Gucci vibes from back in the day. Except he went out a pink bra, his bra would have been gold. <laughs> um, my bag is from Cuba. I think it's made with banana leaves. And my boots are Charlotte Bruce. So what do you think? Oh. I cannot believe it. This look, I can't believe it. I think this skirt was probably about $4. I can't believe it. It looks like a designer outfit. Oh, so excited. Next is my Batman versus Superman t-shirt that I styled as a dress because I can. And I styled it with some Zach Posen tights, my Fashion Nova thigh high boots, and my little jean bag. So the next DC Comics movie that's coming out, this is what I'm wearing. Oh, I think Wonder Woman's coming out, right? Like before the end of the year or the beginning of 2021? This is my outfit. <laughs> Last is this beautiful Grecian look by Ceremony. It's so beautiful. Look at the material, just how it flows on your body. The braided detail on the shoulders and across the bust line and the back beautiful dress. The tie, it wraps around me like two or three times. I was able to do it. Oh, it's so beautiful. I love this dress so much. And I paired it with some iridescent heels to give it more of a ethereal vibe. <laughs> and a little beaded vintage bag. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Let me know which look you like the best. Um, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and hit the bell for notification. Also, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is also Dee Dee Longlegs, and I will see you next time.